Hello, military families. We are David and Jennifer Failert from Texas with the Convention of States Action. We offer you our deepest condolences over the tragic and horrific mission that happened in Kabul, Afghanistan. We'd like to take a moment to honor and reflect on the brave and courageous young soldiers that gave their lives on August 26, 2021. Marine Corps Staff Sergeant Darren T. Hoover, 31, of Salt Lake City, Utah. Marine Corps Sergeant Johanny Rosario Pichardo, 25, of Lawrence, Massachusetts. Marine Corps Sergeant Nicole L. Gee, 23, of Sacramento, California. Marine Corps Corporal Hunter Lopez, 22, of Indio, California. Marine Corps Corporal Dagan W. Page, 23, of Omaha, Nebraska. Marine Corps Corporal Humberto A. Sanchez, 22, of Logansport, Indiana. Marine Corps Lance Corporal David L. Espinoza, 20, of Rao Bravo, Texas. Marine Corps Lance Corporal Jared M. Schmitz, 20, of St. Charles, Missouri. Marine Corps Lance Corporal Riley J. McCollum, 20, of Jackson, Wyoming. Marine Corps Lance Corporal Dylan R. Marola, 20, of Rancho Cucamonga, California. Marine Corps Lance Corporal Kareem M. Nikoi, 20, of Norco, California. Navy Hospitalman Maxton W. Soviak, 22, of Berlin Heights, Ohio. Army Staff Sergeant Ryan C. Noss, 23, of Coryton, Tennessee. Thank you for your service. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So appreciative of all of our active duty service members as well as our veterans. Uh, appreciate you protecting our liberties. I uh, can't say how grateful I am. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I just want to thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for all that you do for our country and for the freedom that we have because of people like you that are in the military. To all of our troops, I just wanted to say thank you for protecting us here at home. We appreciate you and to borrow words from Winston Churchill, never have so many owed so much to so few. Thank you again and God bless you. Thank you. Thank you, and God bless you. Thank you for serving us, for being there, for never standing down. We're here for you. We love you. We support you. And for the families left behind, know that no matter what you hear from the news, we the people are here for you. We'll support you to the end. Thank you. So from all of us at the Convention of States Action, you are in our thoughts and prayers. We will stand with you and demand accountability as our fellow Americans. And just know, we will never forget.